very similar problem. And now it's saying, what is the g of f of 5? So again, ladies and gentlemen, they're asking us in the innermost function, they're saying, what is f of 5? So if we know f of x equals 7x, 7x minus 3, f of 5 is going to equal 7 times 5 minus 3, which equals 35 minus 3, which equals 32. So now we know what f of 5 equals. f of 5 equals 32. So therefore, g of f of 5 is now going to equal 32 squared plus 4. Well, 32 squared is going to be 1,024 plus 4, which equals 1,000. 28. Any questions on this one? Go through. Remember, you're just plugging one um, value or into the other into the function, and then plugging one function into the other function. Okay. Everybody seemed like they're good on uh, inverses.